Welcome back to Astrophotography Part 2. Today we are heading to Gerlach, one of the darkest spots in northern Nevada. According to the light pollution map, this nearby area has minimal light pollution. I really like the terrain here, with its vast mountains and endless flat roads stretching into the horizon. I think it's perfect for night photography. If you followed my series, you know timing is crucial in astrophotography, just like when using Astro Mode on the Pixel 8 Pro. I'm sticking to my checklist here, tripod, check, warm clothes, check, and a clear to minimally cloudy sky, check, all under a black moon. Yes, it's December 30, 2024, we are under a black moon, a day I specifically chose. A black moon, like any new moon, isn't visible in the night sky. Without moonlight, the stars shine brighter, providing perfect conditions for stargazing and astrophotography. So let's see what we capture with Pixel 8 Pro. As we approach Gerlach, clouds have started to roll in, so we had to turn the car around searching for a clearer patch of sky with striking rock formations to enhance the shots. We're parked here now and are waiting for the sun to set. I mounted the Pixel 8 Pro on a tripod and started capturing various parts of the sky. Let me know what you think about the shots in the comments. Don't forget to shoot in RAW and edit your photos later so you can bring out all the details in your shots. You can use Affinity Photo 2, Skylum Luminar Neo or my go-to editing program Lightroom. If you want to learn how to set up for Astro Mode on Pixel 8 Pro and the key things to watch out for before heading out, definitely check my earlier Astro video in the Pixel 8 Pro series. We're packing up to head out. The stars were incredibly bright and we even witnessed meteors carving across the sky. It's not just about capturing a moment but also living it, so I hope you enjoy your time out there. In the next video, I'll take a pause to answer some of the questions I received from you. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe so you don't miss what's coming up. I'll see you on the next one.